such a grand loss. Technique should I learn next?
Challenger!
magical. Presumably in charge. See, that's what I like about you. Your attention to detail. My fairy whiskers were telling me this next fiend bloom is gonna take a more hands-on approach. Gonna need you to watch my back on this one. Come on! This parasite thing is feeding on the life energy of the beanstalk. And I ain't having that. This big beautiful beanstalk must be protected. Yes. The citizens must be defended. Oh, yeah, them too, I guess. There it is. Now keep those things off me. now. Meet me back in town. Come on, let's go. Ooh, that's a long way down, Tomodachi. I hope you got buns of steel. Now get to fight! Whoa! 
What shall I slay evil with today? When it's over. That nasty, nasty, big little mushroom monster awaits! Hello. Come back now, and you might survive. Spare to return.
Welcome back. <laughs> you saved the day, hero. Truly, it is just what I do. The Beanstalk is safe, thanks to you. Also the citizens. Right, right, them too. That's also good. Anyway, thanks for your help. Remember, only you can prevent Sporus Spires. With that, the corruption was no more. And the fairy punch father was free to, you know, go commune with other nature in different places and, let's be honest, probably punch stuff because it's, uh, kind of his jam. Quest complete! and the chicken guts do not lie. Yes, a terrible misfortune will befall our town any day now. A seed of destruction will fall from the sky and all will... to Grindana, the patron god of experience. Fizzy Wilkins! Sorry, that's just something you have to say as an alchemist sometimes. Don't go to 
to stow. Blast and fiddlesticks! The solution is not ready. I need the essence of pure snot. Go to the nearby cave and retrieve it for me. So much man. Huh! <laughs> 
itself with this I can complete the solution now use this improved sea kelp solution on the seaweed blocking your way I am the greatest alchemist alive My alchemy is the strongest in all the land. And so the idiots continued their long, pointless quest, traipsing through the wasteland they made. <laughs> Crushing priceless coral reefs under their boots. The exposed seabed reveals its hidden treasures to you. There was a lot of junk and gunk in the ocean. A lot of flotsam. Flotsam? Are you sure it's not jetsam? Flotsam is stuff that fell off. Jetsam is stuff that got thrown off. Huh. I don't even have a snappy comeback. That's just interesting. Sometimes learning can be fun! Do you see the destruction she leaves in her wake? A wasteland of broken toys, wondering why their creator has forsaken them. But I guess it's all just set dressing to you, Fate Maker. You keep doing you. If only you could ask all the fish you just vaporized if they feel brought together by fate.
Adventure awaits! Somewhere! A gate bars your way, and a gentleman stands just before it. A gentleman wearing a pirate hat. Oh, but he's not just any pirate. He's a skeleton pirate! this gate. Aye, ye be wanting to just waltz right through the gates of the briny shelf, are ye? Will ye be speaking to Bones Threewood, cursed protector of the Southern Gate, and I say... Sure. Wonderful. I had expected more resistance, to be honest. Of course it'll do ye no good. The Nurpin Gate is guarded by a vengeful, murderous, Gorgeous buccaneer, known as Chartreuse La Chance. He'll never let you through. Unless... Would you be willing to help me on a quest? Ho ho ho! Pirate quest! It's a pirate quest! Valentine, do you want to go on the pirate quest? Oh, I really, really do! Ha <laughs> ha! Welcome to the crew! But there'll be no pirate quest without Polly, me faithful bird monculus. A terrible fate befell her, and we be needing to put her pieces back together. Beware, crew. The sea wargs are restless since the ocean were obliterated. You don't want to run afoul of Mobley Pearl, writer of fruit, scourge of salt and sand. Friendly advice. That pirate you're throwing you with doesn't have a loyal bone in his... You know, bones. I hope you leave your peace. Go for the eyes! 
Those be the navigational flappers. Keeps Polly high in the air to spot sails on what used to be the horizon. <clears throat> Glad you could join me. Ooh. 